By default, all Linosity question types are available to the authoring tools. That's every question type, every option within those question types. Now, we recognize that some authors might not want all these options. They might not feel comfortable or be familiar with all those options. Recently, we've released a simple set of options. This is an opinionated set of question types, templates, and options that we've released that you can use to put in front of authors who might be more comfortable using this approach. Think maybe teachers or any other people who aren't as familiar with professional authoring environments. Let's have a look at some of the differences between them. Right now, I'm in the default or the advanced mode. All the usual question type groupings are here with the out of the box templates. This is everything enabled. Now you'll see as I switch to the simple view, I have fewer options. So for multiple choice, we've just given one option. We still have the true false. Choice matrix only has the single option as well. This is opposed to the advanced option, which has several templates each. If we look inside some of these templates, this is the advanced or the default mode. You can see here we've got more options available and there's lots of options in here that your authors can use to create content. However, with this simple mode, we've stripped this right back just enter your question content, have your true and false options, choose an answer and you're done. Again, comparing to the advanced mode where you can add more options, maybe an other or both, you can remove, you can do lots of things in more options. These have been stripped away to the bare essentials in simple authoring. Another example might be classification. This is the advanced mode. You can set column counts and row counts. You can add row titles. You can group your responses. And of course, you have your more options available to set advanced scoring rules, different layout options, and all your usual things like distractor rationale. In the simple mode, We've again stripped it right back. Just enter your question, your possible responses. You can choose columns and have column titles, but row titles are gone, grouping responses are gone, and there's no more options. Again, a much simpler look and feel, just the bare essentials. If we look at one more, we can see a closed text or a fill in the blanks with text. This is the default or the advanced mode where you can have a different area for the question and the template markup. It's the template markup that holds the response containers. And we have the more options available, again, with the advanced scoring options and all the layout options that you might typically want out of the box. Looking at the simplified version, you just have the template, a max length for the characters, whether it's case sensitive, and then your validation. So again, these are an opinionated set of templates to simplify some options out of the box. Of course, remember that all of these templates on the left-hand side, these authoring templates, are completely configurable by any Linosity customer. So you can tailor these to your exact author requirements to whoever you want to put this in front of. You can create as many templates as you want per question type, and you can deliver different templates to different authors. This is available today. Consult the documentation for more information.